Do you have your books? Yes. Oh shit, I don't even know what these books are about. <laughs> Do you want to look for that? Yeah. Do you want to be me? I was going to. Okay. Hey everyone, it's me, Zach. <laughs> just kidding. That was it, that was the opening. This is your thing. This is my thing? Yeah, like, this is your thing. I'm just here for the ride. <laughs> hey everybody, it's Zach, and we are here today with our July TBR. Uh, this is my boyfriend, John, and we're going to show you the books that we're reading in July. That's what a TBR is. July TBR! Woo! Woo. I'm reading Written in the Stars by... Aisha Saeed? Um, yeah, and I believe this is about a girl from Pakistan who lives in the United States, and her parents let her live like a very American lifestyle, but the one thing they're not okay with is her choosing who she wants to marry, um, and um, in the book she falls in love, and her parents are not okay with that, so they send her back to Pakistan, and I think it's just the conflict that arises because of that, and this is Young Adult, and it's a new release, and yeah. That's what I want to read. Well, an ongoing read and process continuing through July will be Storm of Swords by George R. R. Martin. It has a green cover with a helmet on it, which is armor that people wear in the books to protect themselves from no spoilers. swords. Is that a spoiler? Oh, sorry, I ruined it. <laughs> um, but I will be continuing to read this because it's quite an undertaking. How are you? I am on page 182. Out of, out of like, one thousand one hundred or something like that. <clears throat> you keep talking because I'm reading inside. But okay. Oh, Thomas suddenly stopped being gay. Aaron must turn. Um. Do you just like pick random books? That no, it's like books that other people have books to about reading. Oh, you're like I'm gonna read this this month. Oh wait, I have no idea what this is about. No. Pretty much. The Fine. next book I will be reading is More Happy Than Not by Adam Silvera. This is a young adult book, I believe, dealing with sexuality. There's been a lot of talk about it on BookTube, and I'm very thankful that I was able to get my hands on it so quickly since it is a new release. The next book that I will be reading is called The Happiness Project by Gretchen Rubin. It's kind of her story on thinking about what happiness is, how we can attain happiness, why we look for happiness. like. Wasn't she a lawyer? Yeah, she was a lawyer and then she decided that she wanted to be a writer, so she became a writer, but it's... She has this like epiphany when she's on the bus one day about happiness and decided to write a book about it. And each month she focuses on like a different aspect of her life that she wants to change. Yeah, like January is boost energy, February is remember love, March is aim higher. So each month she focuses on a different thing and... I've gotten a lot of insight from it so far that I've been applying to my real life, unbeknownst to Zach, but I have been trying. The next book I will be reading is The Last Time We Say Goodbye by Cynthia Hahn. I picked this up back in April at my old library, really loved it, but I had to return it um, and I didn't get to it. Um, it's about a girl who um, is kind of dealing with the aftermath of her brother's suicide, and I just realized that I'm reading a lot of really happy books. That's sarcasm this month, so. Everyone's gonna be like, he's so funny. I know. Do not put that in there. And the other book that I will be reading, I actually just got today. It's called The Inner Voice by Renee Fleming, who a lot of people just like became familiar with her when she sang at the Super Bowl, but she's probably the most famous opera singer in the world right now. And as an aspiring opera singer, I thought it would be good to pick up. It's about her journey. She calls it an autobiography of her voice, not necessarily of her life, and just her artistic journey to international success uh, as an opera singer. So I am very excited to really begin reading it. I like the cover. She's amazing. I love her. Just look at her. The final book I will be reading this month is Challenger Deep by Neil Schusterman. Obviously, Neil Schusterman is a quite famous author. Um, this is. Sorry. This is one of his uh, new young adult releases. Um, I believe this deals with mental illness. Um, yeah. Smooth. <laughs> so those are the books that we will be reading during the month of July. Like always, I will go ahead and leave my social media information, um, including my Goodreads. Feel free to add or follow me there. I'm also going to go ahead and leave Sean's social media in the information bar below, uh, including his Goodreads, because he has one of those. Feel free to add or follow or whatever him. <laughs> and then when I say, 
And until the next time, we say happy reading and we wave. My god. What? <laughs> That's so lame. <laughs> That's so lame. Okay, but I'll do it anyway. Because <laughs> you love me. Let's just do it. Okay. And if you liked this video, please feel free to subscribe and leave a comment telling me what you'll be reading during the month of July. And until next time, happy reading. Happy reading.